is the energy vibration reading for Cancer Sun, Moon, and Rising. It is the third week of December, and the week begins from the 18th until the 24th. This is going to be a wonderful week for you, Cancers. Um, a lot of money and the Wheel of Fortune is here for you guys. The Empress is going to be your overall energy for this week. So your financial needs, whatever you need, your financial needs will be coming in. As we look forward, we are going to look at the energy of this week, and it's a fire week. We begin the week with fire on the Thursday. We change on Thursday until the, the for the energy of the heart energies. So okay, let's look and see what is going on in your week. It's good because you're starting something. The number two energies are here. The energies of duality is here. Um, your lucky day is going to be on Monday because you're going to start something with someone and it's just going to be good so the energy of the Empress celebration um, so you could be connecting with someone who is a Capricorn woman and there is going to be a celebration so you could be connecting um, some of you will be connecting with a Capricorn woman and there is going to be a real nice celebration this is going to be good for you guys so let's look Monday is a very lucky day for you you have dualities of the number two um, on Monday you'll be working together with someone who's um, to build something in your life so this could be your partner but um, it could be somebody else outside that you're connecting with and you're going to start building something good in your life with this person so this could be a relationship or someone that you have met and you're trying to build something in a positive energy in your life on Tuesday you have the energy of the wheel of fortune whatever your financial situation is the wheel of fortune is going to bring you money so if you were thinking about balancing out your financial situation the wheel of fortune is going to bring money in your life and this is going to be good crowning off your week is a lot of worrisome um, um, worry some thoughts that is in your mind but you you needn't worry because um, messages good messages are coming into uh, to you okay so um, there's a lot of worrisome thoughts that is going through your head but you have nothing to worry about because you have the energy of the six of ones and that is um, good news is about to come to you as we look at your energy on Thursday another wonderful energy on Thursday you have the energy of the magician and it's as if you're going to be connecting with the love of your life and this is going to be wonderful and positive because you're going to be feeling a very happy um, maybe you have not had contact with this person for a while and then all of a sudden um, you two come back together and this is going to be wonderful because it's as if uh, the universe the magician bring you back to this person or this person back to you as we look at Friday on Friday if you had a relationship with someone between the ages of 25 and 45 they will be looking forward and looking for another relationships it can be that some of you were with this person this person have another relationship with someone else who um, someone else who is the knight of ones who is between the ages of 25 and 45 this could be someone who is an Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius and uh, she is turning her back on this person and looking forward so this person could be realizing that whoever this person was they have lied to her and she's looking forward and looking out and leaving this person behind and wishing that she never had contact with this person as we move forward on a Saturday which is a wonderful day whoever you are on Saturday money is going to be coming at you you're going to be um, uh, victorious and successful over your financial situation so on Saturday a lot of money will be coming in to you so if you have a business on Saturday it's going to be good it is a lucky day as we move on and we look at Sunday you have the energy vibration of this woman this woman is someone who is a, uh, a older woman who is at Pisces um, a cancer or a scorpion 
and um, this could be yourself also whatever that has transpired is the tower is going to blow up and let's look and see because for you women obviously there is a situation that has taken place for you cancer women and the tower has blown up so let's look and see what is happening for you cancer women oh yeah okay okay is as if you cancer women um, you cancer women saw something coming you cancer women knew that something was not built on solid ground you found out about the situation someone a woman and you found out something about another woman and it is 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 your daughter or your sister or your um, your your sister-in-law that sort of a thing and the tower blown up and you're seeing this person you saw this person how jealous and how hateful they are and you are moving yourself away from this let me ask another question what is happening it's a sort of a jealousy yes you're bringing an end you are bringing an end whatever it was you're bringing an end to this situation this woman you are bringing an end to whoever this whoever this person was you're bringing an end to it and you're moving away if this person was jealous you're bringing an end to it and you're handing whatever that has been happening so this is very very good so as I look at your reading again you have a this is a week of worrying for a lot of you cancers but you have no need to worry because whatever is happening you on Monday you're going to start to try build something together with someone else some of you are going to be connecting with the Taurus um, and it can be that you are and you're going to be celebrating something with this person on Monday so you know this could be good that you're connecting with this person and uh, um, this person is going to help you to build something in your life on Tuesday you know it's wonderful because what is happening is that you are um, the wheel of fortune is going to bring you success and Saturday you're going to see the success coming out in your life on Thursday you're connecting with someone who you miss it's as if the universal angels brought this person back into your life and you're bringing this person you're connecting with this person whoever um, it's as if you were in a relationship with someone who's a woman but um, that is uh, and um, Aries Leo or Sagittarian and you had a relationship with her and she was seeing someone behind your back or she was listening to someone and she's realizing now that the person wasn't telling the truth okay but whatever happened this week is going to be a good week for you you have the energy of the five of earth um, you have and whenever the energy of the five of her comes out let's see what is happening for you guys with the energy of the five of her because the five of her is always about your materialistic things so um, you can see that this is coming up um, with an, a worrisome energy the energy of the five of earth is alternative form of abundance the illusions of lack so stop with the illusions it's not just an illusion that you are locked it's just an illusion overlooked treasures you're not seeing the treasures that you have in your life you're overlooking things all is not as it seems to be so this is a time to look again a change in perception can bring into focus the result you sought just in a different form then expect um, the result to be good you are called to move away from poverty uh, poverty stricken consciousness and open up your eyes to the treasures before you that are suddenly illuminated the illumination of wealth gives weight to the true abundancy there is no need to fear that the rug will be pulled out from underneath you what we draw attention to grow so you count um, your blessing and realize that you have all that you need to have so it's it's a wonderful positive time you have come far in your quest for building up what you need and even with more opportunities for experiencing abundancy awaits you so this is very good so you have no need you need to release yourself of a lack in this week because there is no lack uh, lack of things going on if you have any question 
the answer is going to be big happy changes is coming for you big happy changes is coming for you so you need to remove yourself of lack because there is going to be big happy changes coming in for you and that mean your financial situation is going to be much better than you think big happy changes big positive changes are coming into your life you may find yourself on a new career part entering a new relationship or move into a new home or city embrace these exciting events knowing that your angels will be beside you all the way what you're asking about may require you to take leaps of faith that seems frightening or beyond your ability trust that the opportunities before you were meant to bring you happiness these opportunities would not have presented themselves unless you were ready for them release your fears and allow your heart to be open so this is wonderful again I was pushed um, to look at your reading again because there are certain things um, that um, should be asked and you're crowning off your reading have the nine of swords and with the energy of the nine of swords the nine of swords is always your worries your thoughts your worries about your financial situation your worries and thoughts and you have nothing to worry about because good news is coming there is a lot of talking and a lot of situation but good news is coming the energy of a positive um, information are coming at you you need to release yourself from worries because worries is a fear that wants to keep you in fear and have um, you know have a hope that your financial situation or whatever your worries uh, is all about that it will be good in balance okay that things are going to be working out in your favor and you have you know worries um, um, there is a lot of you are having doubts about your relationship and worries about your relationship a lot of people are having doubts and worries about your relationship and you need to release this because um, it's just uh, uh, you know once you uh, focus on the sort of a thing this is what you bring in your life Saturday is going to be one of your best days it's going to be a very lucky day Monday you know there is a situation with someone who is a Taurus or a Virgo or a Capricorn I'm feeling the energy for you guys as a Capricorn and there is going to be a celebration with you and this person on Monday you two are going to be coming together to build on something and this is going to be good because it's is going to bring you positive energies forward okay so whatever is happening for you guys is going to be a wonderful week not to worry about it it's going to be okay I want to say namaste enjoy your week until next week